welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel my name is miss tamika i upload videos once a week which is sunday at four and then i also throw in a bonus video throughout the week and with that being said if you want to see what i have in this package stay tuned and keep on watching I wear wigs i have been wearing wigs for over the past 10 years i'm not a wig expert but i did uh place an order for a wig on Amazon and of course you know I wanted to share it'll be my first uh, wig review on my channel I do like crochet and braiding tutorials and things like that but I never did a wig review before I get started I'll just give you a little uh, back end on the uh, brand the wig came from a brand called cool today's a short lace front human hair and it's a Brazilian Remy hair bob and it is 12 inches, 100% uh, density. Again, I'm not sure with that, I guess the thickness of the wig. Like I said, I'm not a wig expert. Wearing wigs, we didn't pluck the, the line. We didn't pluck the hairline. We didn't make baby hair. We didn't put concealer in it and things like that. You just, you know, used to put it on, fix it, make it look cute and keep it going. Now you may take a razor and kind of shed it down if it was too full or something like that. So all this is new to me. I just wanted to, you know, share this with you guys really quick. Because like I said, uh, when I do put the wig on, I'm not sure if I'm going to do the whole baby hair and, you know, plucking up the part. I just want to actually show y'all how it looks when it comes out the package first before I put it on. Give you a little um, bit of info on the wig. You can bleach the knots. And again, back when I was... When I started wearing wigs, we didn't bleach knots and things like that. So I'm not really sure on how to bleach knots. I'm sure if I watch some tutorials, I can figure it out. This hair, you can dye. And the cap size is average, meaning that it's a one size fit all. And I guess if it's too big, you can adjust the straps. And this wig do retails for $57.99 on Amazon. And I was able to use my Amazon Prime, which I got the wig in two days. So here is what you would get if you do place the order. So it says cool today, but then here it says this on the packaging. So again, I'll leave the actual link that I use to purchase this wig down in the description box. Come with a wig cap. Now I normally don't use these type of wig caps. I usually use the solid black. And I notice people starting to use like the skin tone wig caps. I don't know what's the difference because like I said, I just buy my wigs, put them on, fix them, and make them look cute. For the sake of the video, I will use what came with the actual wig just so y'all can see. It's a breathable uh, wig cap. Maybe that may make a lot of difference because honey, in the summertime, my wigs be hot, y'all. Here's the packaging. And I... And when I buy wigs, my price range is no more than $40. Like, a lot of my wigs, I don't pay a whole lot for. So, this is the first time that I actually spent, you know, almost $60 for a wig. And I will say that the texture of the wig is a lot different. Like, it's thicker. Maybe that's why, that's why it says that it's 150% density. So, I don't know if that has something to do with it. So I will have to, now it's, now it did come pre-plucked. I'm going to mess with that right now. I may put just a little bit of concealer in there just so I can show y'all. And I will have to flat iron the top because as you can see it's uh, in this raw state. I'm supposed to wash it. Again, I'm not going to do all that right now. It doesn't say to wash it before use, but I did see some people wash the wig. I don't wash my wigs. Like I said, I'm just going to use it how I use my wigs. I don't wash my wigs. If it's old, I'll toss it because like I said, I don't pay a lot for wigs. I may treat a little different because this was $60. So what I'm going to do, uh, let me show you. It do come with a lace in the front, the cut. And the lace is not full across. It's just right here in the front area. Then it do come with the two combs. Now, when I get wigs, I have it has to have combs. I don't like wigs that don't have combs 
in the front or even the back. I can deal with having combs not in the back, but at least in the front because who wants to have a wig on and the wig can just fly off your head. So it has to have combs in it, in which it do have the combs in the back. You have the adjustable straps so you can make it you know bigger tighter or however you need to do this side it feels real soft like this feels like a quality wig like i said i don't pay a lot for my wig so it it do feel good quality and i don't buy bob type of wigs i always buy these types long with curls in it so this is a, something a little new you guys so i'm gonna see how it looks let me go ahead and do what i need to do and i will be back with this wig on and y'all let me know you know down in the comment section how y'all like the wig on me so give me a few minutes and okay y'all here i go i'm back i got the wig on i did have to like i said cut the lace and the reason why i have this shirt on because i wanted y'all to actually see the full the fullness of the wig i didn't want no shirt to take away from the wig because it is a bob I'm wearing long wig so this is a whole new look for me cut the portion of the lace in the front i didn't do baby hairs i'm not sure if i will let me know if y'all think i should i would have to probably look at some videos just so i can see how that works this review is for people that don't know how to do the whole you know bleaching of the knots uh concealer baby hair and all that this is just straight out the packet cut the lace and you know I put it on my hair. I did bump it with my uh, flat irons. I'm going to tell you the things that I use. I did use some flat irons out of flyaways. So I didn't have like that. Um, I don't know what it's called, but I see a lot of people use like it looked like a stick of deodorant. And it's something that you can use to lay down uh, flyaways. I may have to go to the beauty supply store to look into that. Again, I'm not sure the name. If y'all do know any names of that. If y'all know what I'm talking about, let me know down in the comments section. So I just had to use what I had, and I had used the uh, Jam Extra Hold. I do own a flat, uh, what is it? I do own a straightening comb. I did see people use straightening combs, but I have the old school straightening comb, which you have to put it on a stove, and I'm scared to do that because I may burn this hair. So I didn't want to use that, so I just, again, used what I had. So I used the Jam. It doesn't weigh down your hair like regular hairspray so when I do have when I do want to put spray on my wigs I, I use the uh, wig shine and I got this from I got this from the beauty supply store and it was only a dollar ninety nine so and I use scissors of course to cut the front area and like I said this is in its raw state I didn't you know use any concealer or anything like that so this hair is so soft y'all it's a big difference verse versus my 20 30 dollar wigs like this wig feels this wig feels really really good y'all like look at that i feel like cardi b <laughs> y'all oh my goodness is this the new miss tamika for 2019 mm, y'all i'm feeling myself honey wigs you can become whoever you want like you know I'm just saying. The ending results, I will turn around in the back so y'all can see how the back looks. It's real bound. It feels really nice. You do have to use some type of curling wand. Not a curling wand, but you will have to use some type of flat irons just to give it a little bump. Because when it came out the packet, it was just like really straight. Yeah, I'm, yo, I'm just feeling myself. Give me a minute, y'all. I'm just like, oh my goodness, this looks so cute. Pictures, and I, uh, I'm i going to post them on my Instagram. So I'm going to leave my Instagram. Um, I'm going to leave my Instagram information across the screen so y'all can go ahead and follow your girl so y'all can see some pictures. Put on any shirt or sweater because I wanted y'all to see the, the way it actually hangs and y'all can see my body in it. Cause you know sometimes if you if i had a shirt you know you would just see like just the top part i just wanted y'all to get the full effect of the hair uh this thing is just too cute i'm gonna have to think of a name for her this is gonna be my alter ego wig honey 
And I can imagine if I put a hat on, let me put, let me get my hat that I always wear. My hat that I love to death. Look at that. That is cute. I love wearing a cute hat. That's why y'all always seeing me with hats on and stuff like that. Like that looks so cute. I wanted to show y'all how it looks with a hat on because y'all know I love me a good hat. So yeah, I just wanted to share this with you guys. I love this wig. Oh my goodness. <laughs> So before I go, I wanted to say Happy New Year's. It's 2019, y'all. Like, yes, it's January, and we're going to get this year started with good things, money, wealth, new opportunities, everything. So, you know, we're going to get that weight loss going on. We're going to start looking good for the new year. We're going to have positive vibes. My YouTube channel going to grow to over 10,000 subscribers because I'm claiming that in the name of Jesus, y'all, honey. If y'all like these types of videos, give this video a big thumbs up because I do have another wig that I purchased uh, a few days ago. So if you like these types of videos, like I said, give this video a big thumbs up because it helps out my channel. And also, before you go, please don't forget to click on that subscribe button and that notification bell so y'all can be notified each week when your girl uploads videos. And until next time, I'm talking to you. Got me running around and I never change you. Your face so pretty to me, makeup ain't made.